Hi, I'm Ashley from Clever Touch, and I'm about to take you through how you can install the Zoom application on the Android part of our Clever Touch UX Pro screen. So for the purpose of this session, I'm going to be showing you how you can install the Zoom app on the Clever Touch UX Pro. So firstly, click on present, then click on apps and click on Chrome. Once you've clicked on Chrome, in your web address, if you search zoom.us, this will bring you to the Zoom website. From here, once it's downloaded, we will uh, click on resources, which is just up here. And then we'll click on download Zoom client. In order to download Zoom, you just click on download from Zoom. What that will then do is, do you want to download the Zoom app? So we just click download and that will very simply take us through to downloading the app. With the app downloaded, we're now going to install it. So I'll click on my home file and then we'll click on files. At this point, make sure that you've got storage enabled, which is the top section, and then click on download. What you'll see in here is the Zoom APK. Click on the app and it will ask you if you want to install it and you can say yes to that or just once. At this moment in time, click on install and it will install the app for you. At this point, with the app installed, you can either click done or you can open the app straight away. We're just going to click on done. Back onto my little floating toolbar and onto the home button from here. At this point, click on your apps file and you'll see the Zoom app has now been installed directly here. Click on the Zoom app to open it and it will ask you to sign in with your specific details. With your sign in information complete, click on sign in. This will now take you to the user page where you can start a new meeting, you can work with um, sharing your screen and you can even schedule in new meetings. At this point, we're going to join a new meeting. Click on join, type in the meeting ID, which I will find for you now. So, 825-1623. Now I can rename myself at this point as well. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to rename uh, my screen to Clever Type so it's very clear when we're bringing in a clever touch screen because at this point we're going to be sharing the screen back to anybody within our meeting space so click on join meeting and that will bring us into our meeting space uh, it will ask me for permission at this point and we can just say got it and then I just need to allow zoom to record audio if needed as well so click allow and then I can click on the share button this will um, allow me to demonstrate that back to you. So let me just allow screen sharing. And we can now share our screen back. So click on screen and I'll now be sharing my screen. At this point, click on the little don't show again and click start now. And then also make sure that you've ticked the little box that says allow display over other apps. So we can click that button and that will allow us to record back. So again, just hit the back button and you'll see that we're now recording screens.